freaking multi kill! Yeah! Get open. of Handsome Jack, before he became the torturing, mass-murdering CEO of Hyperion. Back when he was just a coder, a husband, and soon-to-be father of the aforementioned Angel. There's a hidden chamber behind that portrait. You'll have to move it out of the way. Don't worry. That button is perfectly disinfected. I never even touch it with my hands. From our findings in the vault, I believe sirens are able to imbue memories into physical objects. It may not even be a conscious effort. I recovered one of Angel's childhood toys. Start there. You are looking for a stuffed toy Thracian tetra bear. Just as cuddly as the real thing, minus the neurotoxic claws. Angel, and who is this guy? Captain Bear, he eats crime. Well, we must be eating a lot with that big belly, huh? Hey, Angel, darling, what, what's that on your arm? Did you do that? Blue, I don't know where it came from. Do you think it's pretty? Yeah, sweetheart, it's, it's real pretty. Hey, honey, can you get in here for a minute? I was correct! That was a memory from when Angel's powers first manifested. There are other items she might have interacted with. Look for an old vending machine. I'm sorry I didn't see you standing there. Uh, don't say any of those words that Daddy said, okay? Okay. Is the machine broken? Yeah. Looks like no candy for us. Hey, why don't you go back into the waiting room with Mommy, darling? Huh? The doctor's gonna be here any minute, okay? I 
think I can fix it. What the hell did you just do, Angel? Like most sirens, it seems using her powers became instinctual soon after acquiring them. She had no concept of what a phase shift even was, only that she could talk to machines, and more importantly, that they listened to her. There should be a turret somewhere in the room. Find that next. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> 
where it is. Simply touch it to trigger the memory. Mommy! Daddy! Help! Look, you... Bandit. Just give us back our daughter, okay? Are you kidding? She's a freaking siren! I'm gonna be a trillionaire! You and your wife get out of here before I sick my turrets on you! Forget the kid! Go make another one! No! I wanna go home! Shut up, kid, or I'll... Hey, what the... I wanna go home! Let's get down! girl's scars run deep. There's one more artifact. Look for a Hyperion communication satellite. Sweet little angel, you're in that chair for your own good, okay? You're such an asshole! Language? <laughs> Look, sweetheart, I can't let you out because of what you did to your mother, okay? I just couldn't bear it if something else happened to you. I didn't mean to. Shh, I know, darling. That's why you need to stay in that chair. But I got you something. That chair is connected to the entire Hyperion network. Now you can see through every satellite we own around every planet in the sky. You've got the best view in the whole universe from that chair. We're gonna work together. You and me, Carol. Sound good? Yeah. Okay. I love you, Angel. I love you too, Dad. Angel spent most of her life chained to Hyperion technology. With those memories, I think I have enough to fix the water purifier now. Go to Roland's rest, and I will attempt to interface with it. memories did indeed contain the information I required. It seems the Hyperion water purifier had a planned obsolescence chip inside it. I'll simply override it and we can be done with this water chip nonsense. We did it, Vault Hunter! And all it took was reliving the traumatic childhood of a fallen angel. Let Vaughn know his water purifier is working once again. again! That's awesome! Water slide city, baby! Ooh, slick, wet, shiny, glistening. Oh yeah, also, uh, no one's dying of thirst, so that's pretty good, too.
Man, am I glad to see you. Could use a hand over here. Been setting up a new home base. But the COV... Been sneaking up on us out of this tunnel. Freaking hundreds of them. So I'm holding them back while Tina collapses the whole damn thing. She's up above working on a plan. Go help her out. <clears throat> Everything's <sighs> under control, Brack, okay? I just need a teensy bit of help up here. So let's blow up some crap. All we gotta do is collapse the tunnel, and as with most problems, this one can be solved uh, with a bomb. But, unfortunately, Miss Boom Bottom got stuck, and I can't knock her down, so I'm gonna need you to stop it. I'm gonna need you to stop it, good! Wait for it. Okay, crap. Gonna have to do this the hard way. Shorty, you're gonna have to scurry on down into the tunnel and uh, shoot her till she booms, okay? Doesn't that mean we're gonna have to open up the tunnel? It's full of COV! I know what I'm doing, just do it! Besides, we can waste a few COV. Let's do this, big man. All right. Here it comes. Three, two, punch time! And a boom for you, and a boom for you! Hey, uh, guys. The base has been under attack while you are messing around with the... I could hold them off, but they're gaining ground. Get back here! That's right, Vaulty Vault! Get them, suckers! <laughs> it's time to save Boomtown! Boomtown? I thought we were calling it the Fortress. That's dumb as butt! We're calling it Boomtown because I said so. And because I already made it. I don't see why you get to just. La -la 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 -la, not listening to you! La -la 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 -la. Boomtown! <laughs> you two are so cute when you fight. Now let's go save Boomtown. Help me fight him off, Bald Hunter. We gotta secure our new turf. Show him what you got. Vault Hunter. The fortress is secure for now. Boom down. Boom down!
mission, thanks to my magnificotacular bombing prowess. You're welcome, everybody. We smashed them good, Vault Hunter! And took back Boomtown! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Morty, quit copying me! What? I thought we were, like, doing a thing there, man. We weren't. Yeah, Morty, we weren't. Ah, we're just kidding. You're all right, Birdman. All right, you ready for this, girl? All right, you ready for this, girl? Okay, so I needed someone to watch my fuzzy shanks, little hottie boy, Enrique the Fourth, and I thought I could trust my bestie pet Skag with my sexy exy Shiga, but now she won't give him back. But that's okay. I think she's just having some, you know, some sad times right now, because you know, I broke up with her ass. But now she's holding my Enrique like a cuddle hostage. So here. Take these happy little heart decorations, and uh, we're gonna go get my skag back. Okay, great. Now get you over to Casa de Shiga, and then we're gonna brighten her day. Metaphorically, though, so not 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 like with a bomb. <laughs> Trying to solve this one with smiles for a change, you know. Character growth, bitch. Yo, for reals though, I I got to get my Enrique back. I killed the whole world for that sweet little monster boy. Hey, I promised myself I would not lose another. So oh. cry, Tina! See, Enrique, too, he got eaten by a bigger skag, which oh, sucked. And then, Enrique the Three died at the farmer's market. Don't want to talk about that, but, you know, so. Can't go back to the farmer's market anymore. Give us Tina's skag and we'll leave you alone. All right, sacrifice it is! Sick em, hounds! Chiga, just give me back my Enrique sweetie buns and I'll call off the ruthless exterior decorator, okay? Every skag you've ever owned is dead! Enrique's better off with me! Oh, she did not. She did not just. Okay, we were trying to do this the nice way, but now this bitch gonna get it. She's gonna get it. Yo, my one. Kaboom! <laughs> now get in there and find my fluffy little joy muffin, Enrico Suave. And if she.
Shiga hurts. One sweet little scale. Oh, my sweet little boys. Sweet little skag butt. <laughs> I'm gonna rip her face. And I'll put her face down her own throat. And I'm gonna take that. I'm gonna put it in a bomb. I'm gonna send it to space. <laughs> That's one of Shiga's evil gags. Kill it! Thank you. Next! Those gags are bad to the skelly. Evil runs deep. Come here, sweet boy. I won't bite if you don't. Bad boy, Enrique. Excuse me? He is not a bad boy. He's the best boy! The bestest! Bad, bad boy! <laughs> she heard my Enrique. <laughs> All right, that's it. But you know what to do. Thank <laughs> you. 